You're in your assignment when people's demons start manifesting around you. And how do we know this? Because if you can hear into the spiritual realm, like a lot of us who have spiritual gifts can, then you'll start to see patterns, okay? And a pattern I noticed was, so I was um, trying to learn about like financial literacy. So I was listening to all these videos and information on like finances, how to increase your finances or um, like business strategy. And I noticed that the demons that are usually like manifesting and angry that I can hear, I wish I could hear only angels, but that's not how it is for some of us who have gifts, you know, like especially, yeah. So we often hear the not good spirits, but they're also um, confirmation for us. So I seen a pattern that if you're, when I was listening to these videos on like increasing my finances, these demons were not upset. In fact, they were quiet, like they weren't upset. So it made me think like, I'm not in my purpose. You know, like here I'm learning, learning these things about like how to increase my finances and how to like start all these businesses and things, financial literacy, right? But they weren't upset. So then it, I was like, wait a minute, it's quiet. You know, when I usually hear them like upset and he's, they're the most upset when I'm doing something like this, like the videos, when I'm in my purpose. And that's why even though the, okay, let me continue because I wrote this all down. Okay, again, I have my journal ready when I got this download. But um, so this showed me that I was not on assignment. Okay, when it was quiet, when I was learning about that. God will provide for your needs as a believer, as a believer. God will provide for your needs as a believer. Matthew 6, 26. Behold the fowls of the air, for they sow not, neither do they reap, nor gather into barns. Yet your heavenly Father feedeth them. Are ye not much better than they? The main thing or the main purpose is your assignment. Your main purpose is your assignment. Your assignment is a disruption to the kingdom of darkness. Therefore, perceive people acting strange or hating on you as confirmation you are in alignment with God. That is why I keep doing these videos. It makes the devil super angry. Even though the system shows only X amount of people are viewing it, God is always in control. He could use this, the content in these videos years after I'm gone to help or save another soul. Or in the few viewers that I do have now, he will put a video in front of their eyes at exactly the right time where he will use it to get an important message to them or solution to a problem this is the god we serve how do i know because he's used other people's videos in this same way when i was going through difficult difficult times he'll put the right person and the right message to speak to you like i know this works this is this is God. Like he uses these videos to do for his work, to like communicate with us, to help um, support us, to help give us resilience, to help encourage us during the tough times. Okay, that's how God uses these videos. His timing is always perfect. He controls time. Decree and declare he is always in control and he will show up more in that way to confirm it. It is our belief and faith that gives him a stronger presence in our life, in our lives, which ultimately is the best thing. Having your all-powerful, all-knowing, all-seeing Father in heaven by your side, walking with you, because he's in heaven, but he's also everywhere at once, is the best thing. The walk is not easy. That is why it is referred to as a narrow path. There will be things that coming against you from both sides, making you feel more uncomfortable than if you chose the broad path as a non-believer. Look at what Jesus went through. It was painful and tough. Yet he said, not my will, Father, but your will be done. After his intense suffering, being ridiculed, tortured, then dying on the cross, God rose him again from the dead to become the King of Kings that saves all of mankind. 
from from our sin hallelujah whatever thing you are doing that has the most opposition for example like the crucifixion i mean that was everyone coming against jesus right the very people he was healing and saved are the ones that put him up there is your assignment never give up on it even though that path is challenging and difficult because of the immense number of ops god is with you work on your relationship with him through prayer reading the bible and acknowledging him constantly he will fight battles for you and give you the strength to endure okay so god wanted me to let you know that too if there's a lot of opposition. If you hear the spirits just like super angry, manifesting, people are acting really weird around you, like you're in your purpose. It's when they're quiet. It's when the kingdom of darkness is quiet. It's a sign that, hmm, this isn't my purpose. Because if it was, then they would be upset. Okay, so let it confirm you. It's That's why it's a narrow path. It is more difficult. There's more opposition. Like, People will hate you just for representing God, just for, you know, trying to get the information about the kingdom of light, you know, decreeing and declaring like the truth to let you know the truth. They'll come against you, but God is more powerful. Jesus and God have dominion. Jesus died on the cross, defeating death, hell and the grave. You can decree it. You can declare it. You can, you can go to the word of God quote scripture it is written Luke ten nineteen. you have given us authority to trample on snakes and scorpions it is written Isaiah 54 17 no weapons that are formed against us shall prosper in the name of Jesus okay anything you ask for in Jesus' name God will give to you or God will answer he hears you here okay, you could simply say God I give these situations every situation of evil coming against me I, I put in your hands my almighty God in heaven and I know you will fight for me. I need only to be still and to know that you are fighting my battles for me. I decree it and I declare it in Jesus' name. Okay, God, Jesus, the Holy Spirit, love you. The bunnies and I love you too. See you in the next video.